All right, welcome back to the channel. My name is Lian Duan. I have been a developer for over 20 years. I focus on DevOps and security in the cloud. Today I'll demo use Gradle to build and publish a Java project to GitLab package registry. The video little markdown file and the project are in my GitLab. The links are below. After you finish the video, you are able to understand GitLab package registry concept. I build information to manifest file to easily tracking the jar file build detail. Use Gradle to build and publish jar package to GitLab. Let's start. Topic is what is a package registry in GitLab? How to use Gradle build and publish a jar to GitLab package registry? Hands on demo. What is a package registry in GitLab? Package registry is used to publish and share packages in GitLab. Package registry has two types, private and public. I'll use the public registry in my demo. How to check package registry location in UI? Open GitLab website, select project, go to menu packages and registries, and then click package registry. The screenshot shows the common entities 1.0 snapshot jar is published. I'll share how to build and publish the jar on the next slide. There are five key items for build and publish a jar file. First, I'll create a deploy token. The token is used to authentication and authorization in the jar publish process. Second, the token is stored in a CICD variable and the Linux as the command will replace a placeholder with a variable in gate.property file. Third, add the publishing in build.gradle file. When you do exercise, change the LAN 24 project ID to your target project ID. How to find the project ID? Log into GitLab, select project, move down to settings left side menu, click General, you will see the project ID. Fourth item, add build detail into the manifest file. The length from 36 to 47 can add build detail into the jar manifest file. The build information will help us verify the build issue, just in case we faced a build consistency defect. The highlighted part is manifest file which generate by a bow lens. The latest step, run gradle w publish command to download the gradle running environment and then run build and publish in the gradle running environment. Next topic, hands-on demo. In my hands-on demo, I will build and publish common entities 1.0.1 snapshot jar to GitLab. Before we jump into hands-on demo, let me share some background. For your information, my Gradle version is 7.4. If you use a different Gradle version, you may need to change a little bit in the publish session in build.gradle file. I put the Gradle official document below for your reference. Project structure is common lab is root project, common entities is sub project. The project will build two entity files for Spring Boot demo project. The common entity sub project is used to build has included two entity classes. Dot GitLab hyphen CI YAML file has two stages, build stage and deploy stage. In build stage, first give the gradle w command to execution permission. Next, save the build result jar file to artifacts. Artifacts detail is on video how to use artifacts in Gradle pipeline. In deploy stage, first use the est command to replace the value common lab deploy token value and build the number in Gradle.property file. Second, give the Gradle W command to execution permission. Third, run Gradle W command space semi common hyphen entities column publish command to publish the jar file. Switch to the GitLab UI. Select um, Projects menu. 
click Common Lab. In the Common Lab, click Selecting Menu. Move down to Registry. In the pan, deploy tokens. Create a token name. Deploy token to. Select two permissions. Read the package registry. Write package registry. Create a deploy token. Copy to save place. Next, add the CICD variables. Select the CICD menu under the settings. Extend variables. Click add variables button. Put the variable name. Paste the value. Select mask variable. Add the variable. Open the VS code. Go to common entities folder. Open it. Select build.gradle file. Change the version from 1.0 to 1.0.1. Save. Open the GitLab have ci.yaml file. Change the variable's name based on our input. Common lab deploy token 2. Save. Commit my change. To 1.0.1. Commit. Synchronize. Switch back to the GitLab website. Open the CICD menu in the Common Lab project. Check the build status. Build in progress. Pipeline is completed. Let's check the registry. Go to the packages and the registries. Select package registry. Common entities 1.0.1. Snapshot jar file is published. All topics are completed. Today we learned GitLab package registry concept, how to add build information in manifest file, and use Gradle build and publish jar file to GitLab. Thank you and see you in the next video.